What's up YouTube, Yan here for Fresh Aquatics. Uh, I'm really pumped today. Tropica shipment came in. I've been looking forward to this day for a while. Uh, it means I'm gonna rescape my 30 gallon. I mean, not entirely rescape it, but I'm gonna change some things around. Put some new stuff in. Uh, I'm gonna show you guys before. I haven't shown that to you, so you're gonna see what it looks like right now. I'll get a close up for you in a second. And then I'll show you what it's like when I get the Tropica stuff in there. I'm really impressed with their products. I've never seen anything come out of shipment looking this good. I don't think these plants will ever look as good as they do now, no matter whose tank they would end up in. But uh, now they're here nor there. Uh, take a video of that once those are in. But in the meantime, let's check out my 30 gallon. So here we are. Uh, things are growing in, looking pretty good. Um, up at the front, I have Liliopsis brazilianus uh, and Mauritius mixed together. Um, over here, I got a Nymphia zenkeri, a red tiger lotus. Uh, just behind it, I have some Wenti green and some Anubius nana, which is also uh, all the Anubius I have all over the tank. Uh, but most specifically, I have uh, Anubius gracilis, very cool Anubius over here on the left. Uh, behind it, I have some uh, Taiwanese moss and Alternanthera reineke. Uh, and beside the Alternanthera is some Hygrophila uh, pinatifola, pinatifola, some something like that, um, and some uh, Rotella macandra, which is not showing any color at the moment, and to the far right, some Rotella indica. Now this red plant coming up. And the mid ground over here is Barclaya longifolia, and just up in front of it, I got some Hygrophila coriambrosa compacta. Uh, not quite sure what this uh, hydrocotyl species is. Um, I was given to me, and I forgot to ask. Uh, yeah. Anyways, uh, I also have some Wenting brown in here. Uh, on the far left. Overall, things look pretty good. Uh, the right side is supposed to have a really good big tree branch, or rather a small tree branch, uh, branching out with some moss on it, but I just haven't found the right one yet. Um, yeah. Hope you guys like it. I'm about to change things up. Uh, the Rotala is going to get moved into another tank and some Ludwigia and some other stuff is going to go in. So yeah, stay tuned for more to come. Hey guys, uh, so it's been about a week and a half since I planted most of the tropical plants. Um, but uh, yeah. Uh, things are looking pretty good. Things are going to grow in, look even better a little bit. Uh, but in the meantime, I'm going to show you what I got. Um, I recently got some Marsilia granata. Uh, it still hasn't shedded its immersed leaves, so um, I mean, it looks pretty good. Uh, but it's going to definitely change by the time uh, it adapts to the submersed condition I have it in now. Um, in any case, in the meantime, uh, enjoy what I got for you. Uh, I'll do maybe a more in-depth video a little bit later about what plants I got here, um, but in the meantime, just check it out. See it in the day on this end, that's an empty lasset. This is a circle for you, check it in the show. Where is the deep cell down for the log? Yeah, it's now the key to run, that the log the bash down is even.
guys like my tank. Um, I'm really pleased with the way it's turned out. I really like my new selection of plants. Uh, I think it's going to work out exactly as I envisioned it this time. <laughs> Famous last words. Uh, in any case, <coughs> I'm waiting for a uh, Cory and Brosa compact uh, to either grow out, and if it does, then I'm going to keep it, and if not, uh, I'll trade it out when the next Tropica shipment of 1 2 grow stuff comes in, which has just been permitted in Canada finally. Um, so yeah, anyways, stay tuned, uh, more videos to come for sure, uh, in the meantime, keep that water fresh, uh, keep it locked, until the next, I'm Ian for Fresh Aquatics, peace. Thank you.